So right now I'm just cleaning the frogs out. I'm gonna address Wilma's hooves tonight, or this afternoon. As you can see, the bars are long, and I'm just gonna put her between my legs. Trim the bars down, and I'm just gonna come right up through here. You can see how the heel's um, folding over, so I wanna address that. Coming down right through like this. John. Yes, Sometimes people don't like it when you talk. Sometimes it's more satisfying to just walk. Okay, so the ball, Stella tells me I should just do this. So, yeah. get this one done quickly. You can add little comments, just don't talk the whole time. Okay, here are the balls. That was almost my finger. Someone from the United States is calling you. That's okay. If it's important, I'll leave a message. Perfect now. As you can see, she wears her toe down right here more. So I'm gonna take this side off just a little bit. And over here. And now I'll rasp. Check the balance, and now I'm gonna roll the toe. So I'll address all this for when I bring her forward. But now I just wanna paint a little bit more off here. Okay, now we'll bring her forward. John, you can tell everybody why it's pink. That's from either getting an abscess in there or she could be just a stone bruise from being out in the pasture fields running around. So usually when it's discolored like that, that means something happened to the hoof. Kind of like we get black and blue marks if we get hit. Um, so it's nothing to worry about since it's lower in the hoof. Um, I'm not seeing anything that would make her lame or anything like that, so I'll just keep, we'll keep an eye on it here. And that's pretty much done. Like and subscribe if you want to continue to learn about the horsemanship and how we take care of the horses' hooves here and what we do at Grace Wakers.